Many designers, even experienced designers, still struggle with color theory and picking the right palette for a design. But in Kittle, we've created a solution that will help you choose the right color palette for your design. And let me show you exactly what I mean, so let's dive in. So here we are in Kittle, and let's say I have this design, which by the way is a beautiful template by Renato, and I'll link his profile down in the description for you to check out. And let's just say I'm not sure about the colors, but I, I'm just not really skilled enough to go in here and change all of these to be uh, what they're supposed to be because there's a lot of colors here. I do want it to be maybe a little bit more tropical, a little bit more vibrant, maybe something like that. Well, if I just go down here over to the right, I can click on this little icon and it's going to bring up project color palettes. So I have more palettes right here and I can auto adjust brightness. I'm going to leave that on because I want it to do the work for me. And then I can start clicking through any one of these. So let's go to one that maybe will work like this mango dreams. It's really vibrant. If I click it, then boom, it did the work for me. And that's looking beautiful. What a cool t-shirt design. Or maybe I want it to be more red like retro summer. I click that and then boom. It has done it for me all ready to go. And you can go through and click any one of these and it will do all of the work for you. Maybe you want more of a blue and orange vibe. Boom, there it goes. Beautiful t-shirt. I can see that mocked up on a tank top or something like that. And it is just as simple as that. Well, let's also say maybe you're working on a really intricate vintage logo. You've been putting flowers in and things like that, but maybe the flowers come in as a different color and it's not matching the other colors that you've already been working on, well, that's totally okay because all we have to do is go down here into the icon for more palettes and then we can click one that will work. So maybe we want it to be all types of red. We click that and then boom, it's done the work for us. Or if we don't like that, maybe it's a flower shop so we want different kinds of uh, floral colors like candy shop here. We click that and then boom, it's really nice. It's vibrant. It's got several different types of colors in it. Or maybe we want to go down here and we want to do something more earthy, boom, click it, it's done. It's just as simple as that. Well, what if you've been working on a layout in a different program like Illustrator? That's fine too. If I go to my projects, I'll just hit a new project, start with a clean artboard, and then I can go down here to the uploads tab, and then I can actually upload an SVG, which I've done here as an illustration. So if I click that in, boom, I can change the color. Of course, this only has one color, so if I go to the palettes and choose one, it's just gonna choose one of the colors in the palette. But if I were to upload a full layout, then you can still use the palettes feature. So I'll click upload media. I have a couple illustrations right here. I'll just open this adventure logo that I was working on. I'll open it up and it might take a little time to load, but you can still click it. It'll pop up over here. And then if I go to the palettes feature, I can start clicking any one of these and they will take effect. So if I want it to be blue or if I want it to be vibrant or just grayscale, anything like that, you can start working on your own layout with the color palettes feature or you can just go over here to your object colors and change them around to be exactly how you want them. Well, I hope you find that color palette feature helpful. And by the way, if you haven't signed up for Kittle, go ahead and do so using the link down in the description. Then check one of these two videos linked here on my right about color that I think you would really enjoy. Thank you so much for watching and until next time, create magic.